Welcome to Woggle Guides. In this guide, we'll look at how to create email templates in Outlook on your desktop. Let's get straight into it. I'm logged into the desktop app for Outlook. In Outlook, you can create template emails that you can then reuse to send replies and standard format emails. This is quick to do, but it can be a little hard to find if you've not done it before. To create a template, I'll start by clicking on the large new email button. A blank email window is then opened. Moving to the top of that email window, you'll see there are a number of options shown. I want to show some of the hidden options, however. So I'm going to click on the three dots or ellipsis option shown there. A drop down list is then displayed with some further options. And I'll click on the My Templates link to choose it. A new panel then opens on the right hand side of the inbox. This is a view of the existing templates that you can use. I want to create a new template, however, so I'll click on the small blue Add Template link. In the window that appears, I'm asked to firstly provide a title for the template. Now, this is not the subject of the template email. It's the title that will appear in the list of templates we saw earlier. Once I'm happy with that, I'll click into the lower box, and this is where we add the text for our template. I'll quickly create a template thank you email by adding some text. And now let's click on the blue save button to confirm that. You'll see that the new template has now been added to your template list. Let's now take a look at how to use that template as part of a reply in Outlook. I'll quickly click on an email to select it and then create a quick reply to that mail. Once the reply box is shown, to add the template I've created, I'll click on the three dots option again at the top of the inbox and choose the My Templates option once more. To add the template I've created, all I now need to do is click on it once. This email text can now of course be edited and sent on in the usual way. I hope you found this Woggle guide useful and learned something new. If you have, please like or subscribe for free so that you can find out when new guides are available. Thanks for watching and do look after yourself until next time.